Hey dolls, welcome back to Diva Doll Flawless. Today's video is just going to be a super quick nail polish haul. Um, and all of these items were actually purchased from Rite Aid. Alright guys, so the first nail polish that I purchased is from the Wet n Wild Fergie collection. And this one actually has some gold, um, it looks like some gold hexagon glitters inside of it. It's kind of hard to see it with all of the silver nail polish around it. But this one is called Titanium Crush. Number 34269. Titanium Crush. And it's just a silver glitter nail polish with some flecks of gold in it. And I just thought that was a different little aspect to it. Now, the next nail polish, I absolutely had to have it. I actually saw it the first time I went and um, just left it, but thought about it, and I'm like, I need to have that one. This one is called Tonight's Going to Be a Good Night. And this is as well by the Fergie Collection, Wet n Wild. And it's based in black glitter. And this one does also have large gold hexes inside of it, glitter. And I'm actually going to make a glitter mix based off of this one. I just thought this one was so pretty. The next one that I purchased from Rite Aid is also by the Fergie Collection. And this one is called Mountain High. And this is number 34268. And Mountain High is absolutely gorgeous. It has like a white or a creamy milky base to it and then it has some iridescent glitters inside of it and it looks as if it has pieces of gold foil in it and I just cannot wait to use this one I love anything with a iridescent glitter inside of it and then the gold is a nice really nice touch to it so I really like this one and again this one is called Mountain High The next color is from Sinful Colors, and this one is called Full Spectrum, number 1384. And Full Spectrum is so pretty. It has like a soft, rosy pink base of glitter. It also has some chunky pink glitter, and it looks like it also has maybe like a silver and iridescent glitter base mixed inside of it. And I just love this one. This one is so pretty. As you guys can tell, I love glitter nail polishes. All right. The next one is also from Sinful Colors. And this one is called Coffee. And I could have sworn I had this one. This one was from the, I think it's like the country something line that they came out with the little collection and I could have sworn I had this one I might just have had it and just replaced it but I couldn't find it so I did pick it up and it's just a really nice brown nail polish color the next one that I picked up is called Hollywood Walk of Fame and Hollywood Walk of Fame is just so adorable and I think I'll probably mimic a glitter mix off of this one as well as you can see, it's from the Wet n Wild Fergie collection, and it just has a bunch of different stars. They are fuchsia blue, purple, like a lilac color, a turquoise, gold, and I believe maybe even some silvers in there. But this is so cute. And this one, again, is called Hollywood Walk of Fame. All right, guys, the last color I have here is also by Simple Colors. And this color is called Gilded, number 1383. And Gilded looks like it's actually based in a fuchsia and gold fine glitter. And I don't even know. This looks like it has like an opalesque effect to it. But um, it definitely has like some... I, I don't even know like I don't know it's just pretty <laughs> I don't even know how to describe it but it's absolutely gorgeous and I love this little effect right here all right doll so that's pretty much it that's the end of my haul as you can see I did purchase a lot of glitter nail polish I absolutely love glitter nail polish it is truly one of my weaknesses as far as nails go um 
and I don't know whether or not any of you use this nail polish remover but it is called Zoya and as you can tell I am pretty much done with it I'll do a separate review on it but this is what I use to remove my glitter nail polish off of my nails if I place the glitter on either my toes or my natural nails I um as I stated I purchased this from Ulta I believe it's like $9.99 or something like that and um I absolutely love this nail polish I always hear a lot of things about this brand in general um but definitely if you do not have this nail polish remover I say it's worth it um and to definitely if you're into wearing regular nail polish a lot on your nails and you just want something that's really good for your natural nails as well I would definitely suggest getting a Zoya but that's about it you guys um and again Ulta is where I purchased this from if um I do any other nail hauls I'll be sure to show them to you all and as always and until next time have a gorgeous day dolls smooches Mwah. bye